is invented by the Sumerians in Mesopotamia around 3200 BC. Since then, the idea of writing has spread around the world and different writing systems have evolved in different parts of the world. Fourth, which is better, speaking or writing? In one sense, speaking is the real language and writing is only a representation of speaking. However, for centuries, people have regarded writing as superior to speaking. It has a higher status. This is perhaps because in the past, almost everybody could speak, but only a few people could write. Fifth, what are the two spoken forms of language? Most of us are familiar only with everyday language, the language is spoken by the ordinary person, ordinary worldly language. We fail to realize the existence of another quite different and very special language, the language of religion, the language of Dhamma. Everyday language is based on physical things and on experiences accessible to the ordinary person. Being based on the physical rather than the spiritual, it serves only for discussion of physical, worldly matters and situations. It serves only for the tangible things perceived under ordinary, everyday circumstances. Dhamma language has to do with the mental world, with the intangible, non-physical world. In order to be able to speak and understand this Dhamma language, one must have gained insight into the mental world. Consequently, only people who have seen Dhamma, the truth, speak the Dhamma language, the language of the non-material mental world, which is above the physical. Stop, think, share. Share your most essential learning. Comment below.